Hi. Hi. This, welcome to the day in the life. A day in the life of our Journey. life. All right, so we're at it again. We're back to daily vlogging. Journey just got a bath. She is wound for sound running all over our friend's house. She's a little fluff ball now. And yes, we're at a friend's house. We are going to... Hey. Work on some curtains today. Yes. So he has a sewing machine. He said, come over, we'll figure it out. So between me, Tanya, and the floor liquor, I'm guessing we'll have it figured out. She will definitely not be any help, but we will get this done. For sure. So. The first thing we need to do is do some measurements. Um, so these curtains have been our nemesis since mm -hmm. bus building happened. And we finally had had enough of clips popping and flying and people coming and sitting on our couch and curtains falling down. So today we've got curtains. We, we have rods. We, we have all of the things, but these curtains are a little way long, so we need to alter them. And yep. that's what we are doing today. We are gonna go get measurements. We're going to cut them to size, a little extra, and we're gonna hem the bottoms. So, let's go get some measurements. Of course, first thing is, get the tape measure from the toolbox. Let's go. How much farther do you want? I would say 30 inches. E so we need to go. Like 31. It needs to be 31 so you have a one inch overlay. Yeah. All right, so it has been a while since I've sewn. Um, probably like three and a half, four years. <clears throat> so I have to look at the operations manual to remember how to spool the bobbin. Um, we, our curtains are this material here. So I have a light gray thread, if you can see that, there, that I need to spool. So I'm gonna rely on these instructions to help me out. All right guys, so I believe that I have this set up. Everything should be good to go. So I'm going to take this excess material and do a practice run before I try to actually sew our curtains. So let's see how it goes. Let me start on this side. Okay, I think it's good to go, so let's get started. All right, so the next thing we're gonna do is make an inch of a seam, and... Okay, so if you line, yep, yeah, just pull it all the way to the end, okay. and I'll pull mine all the way to the end. Okay, now... Now I'm gonna take a bunch of pins and I'm going to pin this so that way we can be right at an inch. Yeah. So, little story. My grandmother used to sew 
all the time. She made quilts and all sorts of things. Actually, one of the quilts, well, the only quilt that we have in our bus, um, if you've ever seen it, is a quilt that my grandmother made for me. Um, she made all of us grandkids our own quilts when we were um, younger. And when she had passed, she gave me, bef one of the things that she had left for me was her sewing machine. So realistically, I do have my own sewing machine, but it's currently at Dustin's parents because um, I didn't think that I would need a sewing machine on the road. And turns out I actually did need one. But anyway, um, grateful to have our friend lend us his so that way we can make these wonderful curtains. As you can see, I put pins all along the edge here and then I'm going to make my stitch run all the way across the top here. All right, Jorny. It's time to get to some serious business. Huh? Time to get to some serious business. Curtain number one, complete. Check out that stitch job. Not, not too shabby for not sewing in quite a few years. So I'm gonna toot my own horn. Toot toot. So we have sewn three of the curtains that will go all along this side here. So now what we have to do is... Pull this foot off. I'll pull them four screws out. Unscrew the foot. Slide the curtains down the rod. Screw the foot back on. Screw it back in the wall. And finito. Finito. So let's get to work. All right, guys, so that is exactly what our curtains are gonna look like. We've got the black iron feet, the black iron pipe, and the beautiful blackout curtains. We are so excited. This day has been a long time coming. Yes. So now when we have visitors, they can comfortably sit on our couch without these Clips popping Clips off. Clips popping off. And driving us nuts. And these... Where are they going? We are going to rip them to shreds, and then we are going to burn them. Jeez. Yes. That seems hostile. We're going to burn them. We're burning them. Because they have been <laughs> no, the they, biggest pain in the butt. They were they exactly have, what they were supposed to be. Yeah, we, they, they worked well for their purpose that we needed them to be at the moment. But, but now their purpose is done. So with that... 
we need to go finish sewing up some curtains. Yes. We need to finish the curtains completely out tonight. We are gonna stop this blog now. You've got a really good idea of what we got going on and, and how far we have come. So, so with that, we will see you tomorrow. Hasta mañana.